Got on the radar picture right now is a little bit of rain back on off to the west, and that's why you're going to be hunkering down even more today because rain is going to be with us through the vast majority of the morning and evening. Um, it's a pretty good chunk of the day, so keep that in mind. Uh, you get the early morning with nothing, but then by the time we hit 10, 11 o'clock, you already have some rain. That's going to continue to be with us through the 1 o'clock hour. It's still with us at about 4 35 o'clock, and then it's out to the east. As we push into this evening, we clear out a little bit. It, but then for tomorrow, we have a cold front that's going to be coming through with the potential for us to see some moderate to heavy rain in the mix. This is at about noontime today, and you can clearly see Valpo down to Rensselaer and then back around to Calba Morris. And here's the deal. We can't totally rule out the possibility. This, by the way, the absolute latest for my models. Can't rule out the possibility of an isolated thunderstorm within that mix, but really the chance gets a little bit heftier overnight. Boom, right there as we move from about 7 o'clock until around 1 o'clock in the morning as the actual front comes through. That's when there could be enough lift for an isolated severe storm and that's why Storm Prediction Center has us at marginal risk for tomorrow, basically for tomorrow night. So even if there's a rumble of thunder in the morning, it's likely to be garden variety. For today, 45 degrees and rain, but tomorrow we get all the way up into the 60s and that's just enough warmth to see that instability rise enough for maybe some thunderstorms out there. So keep that in mind. We're going to be at about 62 degrees for your Thursday, Friday 41, and then we drop down a little bit, 30s and 40s as we push into Saturday and Sunday.